All right, guys, David really screwed up this time. And nonetheless, let's smash 5,000 likes for YouTube's fastest news network. And if you haven't followed me already on Instagram and Twitter, at the God of News, go ahead and do that. And the fact of the matter is, guys, if you're not subscribed with that bell rung, then you are not up to date. Now let's jump right into it. All right, guys, I'm sure as you already know, David Dobrik now has his own podcast channel. Yes, almost 4 million followers. He said, you know what, these daily vlogs, they're a little bit too much effort. Let me just do a podcast. But as you've seen in Ethan and Hila podcast, guess what? Their careers are slowly going down the drain because they're saying things that either they don't mean or they do mean that they shouldn't be saying. And then people are like, why am I even following these people? So sure enough, David Dobrik is just basically burying himself on the platform causing his channels to die he is slowly dying on the platform because he's saying these idiotic stupid things he says he loves riding motorcycles but he says he doesn't feel free not free enough not free like a bird unless he's not wearing a helmet he said the helmet makes him feel claustrophobic david there are millions of kids and people looking up to you many of which have motorcycles you don't need to be spreading this negativity throughout the earth and the world and the internet that could literally cause someone to lose their life that is a horrible take and horrible opinion he also says he absolutely can't handle nature. He says he absolutely despises nature. He says nature is boring. Nature is old. Nature is 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 is, is trees and, 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 and the environment and stuff when you're out in nature that's been there for millions of years. What's the big deal, he says? He says things that excite him are more of like new things, like technology and stuff out there. Well, hey, that might be a fact, but to really talk bad about nature is a big mistake, and I'll tell you why. We all come from, da from, from nature, David. We all are actually happier in sunshine and nature and around wildlife and such. And to say those sorts of things and to actually inspire and influence kids and people growing up in this world not to appreciate nature, not to spend time in nature, is a big mistake. It's, it makes you look bad as a person, and it, it makes people more down. Like I said, nature and wildlife make people happier naturally because this is how we've adapted. This is how we've, we've been created in this world and slowly loved nature and slowly spent time around plants, animals, and nature throughout our existence. So it's ingrained within us to love it and enjoy it and to be happier around it. Anyways, guys, that's my opinion. You let me know what you think down below. Nonetheless, let's smash 5,000 likes for YouTube's fastest news network. And if you haven't followed me on Instagram and Twitter, at the God of News, go ahead and do that. And the fact of the matter is, guys, if you're not subscribed with that bell rung, then you are not up to date. And thank you so much for watching.